Chat, who's better right now, Cat or KP? I'm gonna I'm put a poll up. How about that? I'm gonna I'm put a poll up right now. Because I'm not gonna lie, man. I just remember the conversations we was having in 2016, 2017, 2018. At the beginning, the unicorns in the league were Giannis, Cat, KP. Maybe Boogie, maybe AD. Those guys were leading the charge. At some point, Cat and Boogie separated themselves from the rest of the crowd. When people were making top 10 lists, Cat and Boogie were in there. The other guys were not. Uh, Gian Giannis was in that group as well. But KP fell off. KP fell off like crazy. Fast forward to 2023, I think there's a, there's been a little bit of reversal to the point where, like, now is debatable between Cat and KP. And that just seems fucking crazy to me. The fact that this poll is 52 to 48, that is crazy to me. You know what I'm saying? Like, it wasn't too long ago when Cat was literally considered the future of the NBA. You know what I'm... Like, over AD, over Giannis, over LeBron, over KD... Motherfuckers thought Cat was the future of the NBA. It wasn't too long ago when KP was on the Mavericks getting called Tingus Pingus and getting cooked because he couldn't post up six foot guards. Now he still might have some problem doing um, problems doing that. But I I remember the slander KP got in Dallas, bro. Two years later, for there to be so much of a reversal. And for, for KP to have a resurgence in his career and for Cat Stock to go down, that now we are having conversations again, whether who is better between Cat and KP, that shit is just crazy to me, bro. I'm not, now that's crazy, man. That's the, I don't know if it's more so of a KP rise or a Cat downfall. I'm leaning towards a Cat downfall, man. The, the Cat Stock has gone down through the roof. Gone down through the fucking roof, bro. Like it, it, it's definitely both. I see what you're saying, but the the Carl Anthony stock has gone down through the fucking roof. 